So, you want to be a bodybuilder? Question. Are you truly doing whatever it takes to reach your goals? Trap Slap Production. Good fucking morning, goddammit. It is cardio time, goddammit. 40 fucking minutes. No matter who the fuck you are, you can accomplish whatever the fuck you want. 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 God damn it. like a fucking lunatic. This is our personal preference of how the fuck we want to look. It has nothing to do with what the fuck anyone else out there, how you think I should look. Sorry, but the truth is, I don't give a fuck how you think I should look. I need to look the way I want to look. That's a good thing, and I want everyone else out there to realize that. So when someone says something, it doesn't get to you. You don't let it get to your head because you're trying to develop the body that you want. Do whatever it takes. Reach your goals. Make your dreams come true in whatever it is in life. And you can always do more. And the biggest fucking fallacy of bodybuilding is this whole thing of you can do too much. Uh, if you work out too much, you're overtraining. Uh, if you eat enough bullshit. That's for lazy fucking people to say that shit. Oh, it's, I've been training an hour. I better not train any longer because I'm going to be overtraining and I'm going to fucking tear my muscles down. So you leave the gym. No, you fucking work out for three or four hours. The more you put into anything, the more you get out. So if this is your dream, my advice to you is just keep busting your ass in the gym.
pump those fuckers up like they've never been pumped before. You want to go to bed in fucking pain and agony and just your arms blowing the fuck up. And that's what's going to cause them to grow. Alright, it is gym time, goddammit. You know, that's, that's the way my mind works. Is, you know, you can never do enough. No matter who you are, you can always do more, you can always become better, you know, you can always become more successful, but you have to be driven for your mind to think that way every single fucking day, you know, and what happens is people get comfortable, you know, they get stuck in a nine to five job, they're making enough money to get by, right, and what do they do? They just stay there, stay at that job for the rest of their fucking life, you know, they never think, fuck. Why don't, I, why don't I try to find something better? And while I'm working here, I'm going to work on something better. Every day your mind is thinking, what can I do that's better? What can I do that's better? What can I do that's better? Rather than just being comfortable and just going to work nine to five, you know, and, and not ever thinking about improving your life or being more successful. And it's the same thing with bodybuilding. You know, you have to constantly be motivated to go to the gym, Kill that shit, get on that cardio, stick to that fucking diet, it's the same shit with success. You gotta be motivated to continually, 24 hours a day, be thinking about what the fuck you can do to be better. You know? And a lot of people out there that, you know, have made it in certain areas of life, bodybuilding, this, that. It's late, I'm fucking exhausted, I've been working all day, but I'm fucking still going to the motherfucking gym, goddammit. Nothing will stop me, goddammit. Whatever it takes, let's fucking do this. I don't give a fuck. Bust your ass, do everything you need to do, whatever the fuck it takes to get your body where it needs to be, and then step on stage and fucking destroy the competition, turn pro, and fucking make some goddamn fucking money out of this sport. It's gonna be a great fucking day. I'm feeling fucking good, and I'm ready to get going. I'm ready to hop on fucking cardio and get this day started. So I hope you guys have a great day, and let's fucking do this. What, what's my favorite fucking word? One favorite fucking saying? One of the first sayings they came up with? Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes. Whatever the fuck it takes.